Hello trader. In today's video, I'm going to share with you the method that marked a turning point in my own trading. It's a method I learned from renowned traders. Traders like Perry Kaufman, Larry Williams, Larry Connors, and Richard Brennan. There are others we could add to this list, but I think these are the ones who have influenced me the most. Now, many of these traders operate in a different environment than the one we have here in Europe. Many of them trade in the United States using futures or the assets and platforms available there. Here, on the other hand, what we have the most access to is MetaTrader 5, TradingView, and CFD brokers. Of course, the range of options has expanded now, and we also have access to other brokers, even to interactive brokers from the United States or TradeStation. But generally, what dominates the market are CFD brokers with MetaTrader 5 and TradingView. So what I have done is learn everything I could about these American traders and their systematic, quantitative, algorithmic trading and bring it into the ecosystem we have here in Europe. And this is my way of trading. I have taken what they do there, researched it here, quantified it and automated it so I can trade it. So what kind of trading are we talking about? What kind of trading do they do? And by extension, what do I do as well adapted to the uh, platforms and tools we have here? Well, it's a portfolio centered trading approach. A portfolio is nothing more than a set of strategies that can operate different strategies on different assets all in a harmonious way so that the overall performance of all these strategies together is superior to the individual performance of each one. Now, let me clarify this a bit further. By overall performance, I don't mean the total profits that this system or portfolio can achieve compared to the individual strategies, but rather the combination of profits, losses, and drawdown. What we aim for when creating a portfolio is to achieve a smoother, more steadily rising performance curve with fewer ups and downs. We seek a higher compound annual growth, aiming to gain more while losing less. Well, the best way to achieve this kind of performance is by creating portfolios building these systems, as I mentioned, with multiple strategies deployed across multiple assets, um, all of which work well together. This is the approach I use today, and it's the method I've learned from all these traders, and it's what I'm going to teach you in this video. Now, what are the steps to create a portfolio? If we really simplify it, we're basically looking at two steps. The first is to create strategies, and the second is to build a portfolio with those strategies. Let's start with the first step, which is how to create a strategy. All right, I'm in MetaTrader 5, and this is the platform I use for my trading. Now, to create a strategy, what I usually do is always start by looking at the type of market I'm going to trade, the type of market for which I'm going to create that strategy. I can create a strategy for American indices, or I can create it for uh, Forex or cryptocurrencies. In general, I'm going to focus on the asset class or the specific asset within that class, uh, because there are some assets within certain classes that also have their own differences. But generally speaking, focusing on the asset class is usually enough. Indices behave differently from currencies, and these in turn behave differently from cryptocurrencies. And in general, assets within the same class tend to share quite a few similarities. Therefore, if I'm going to create a strategy for American indices, I'll take into account different factors than if I were creating one for Forex or for cryptocurrencies or for stocks, which is also a somewhat different market. So once I've considered the asset class and what kind of movements I expect from that asset, that's when I'll start to think about the strategy. And for this, you need trading knowledge. You need to know what makes indices move the way they do, or what makes currencies move the way they do. In indices, there are certain components that make them better suited for trading, trend following, and momentum systems to the upside. Mainly, this is due to how these indices are restructured, the companies that make them up, uh, how these companies change over time, as well as monetary policies. On the other hand, Forex better expresses the relationship between two different economies through their currencies, and this can make mean reversion movements, these kinds of oscillations make more sense and perhaps offer greater advantages in this type of asset. I haven't explored cryptocurrencies too much yet, but it's possible that Bitcoin is very trend driven. And uh, stocks, well, tend to be more trend following markets or rather uh, markets that, that generally move upward. I have a, a stock portfolio and basically what this portfolio does is replace some stocks with others based on which ones meet the criteria I have set for that portfolio. So here you have the main groups of assets. And depending on which main asset group we choose, 
we will select one type of strategy or another. Once we have chosen a type of strategy, the next thing we need to do is start backtesting and optimizing that strategy. And for that, you can use Excel if you don't know how to program or how to develop these strategies with AI, or you can do the same thing by programming a bot and backtesting and optimizing that bot. Here on the screen, we have the MetaTrader 5 strategy tester. And here I have the Swing Expert Advisor portfolio. This is the portfolio I use to run my, my bots, my swing trading portfolio, uh, which is a bit more long-term and longer than intraday trading. And I'm going to backtest this bot from 2012 up to today, which is the 8th of June, 2025. And what I'm going to backtest is only system one. This bot is a portfolio bot, and uh, I haven't yet shown how to create these portfolio bots in the academy. It's a course I still need to make, but I do teach you how to create each of these systems. Each of these systems here is equivalent to a multi-symbol bot, and those you do have available in the academy. The training to create these multi-symbol bots is something I do teach. So what I'm going to do to start is backtest the first one, which honestly, I don't remember right now which one it was. I don't remember which assets it traded or even what strategy it used because I have so many portfolios and systems. It's impossible for me to remember exactly what each of these does. But I want to show you what the performance, what the results of this first system are. So let's run a backtest of this system from 2012 up to today, June 2025. Let's see what we get. Initial deposit of 5,000 euros. I've optimized this portfolio to work with an initial deposit of 5,000 euros. So let's take a look. All right, this is already progressing. Here we can see how the trading works, how trades are open and closed, and how the account grows as a result. Obviously, this is a strategy that has already been backtested and optimized, um, as I teach in the courses. And uh, in fact, in the latest course I've released, uh, the one on creating profitable and robust systems, I teach uh, one of my best strategies. If it's not this one, in fact, I think it's not this one, but it's a better one than this, right? It's a really good strategy. All right, so here we have the returns from this strategy, okay? It made 800 euros in profit over 10 years, which is a little, but with a profit factor of almost two and a drawdown of only 3.28%. And uh, these results, which are very good, all right? This profit factor, and this sharp ratio look at the sharp, it's 2.28. All of these are metrics that tell us whether the system is profitable and whether it has performed better or worse. And these metrics are very good. Now, these metrics, which are very good, are certainly not enough if we want to make a living from this, right? Or to grow an account. 800 euros in 10 or 12 years is not enough. But this is just one system out of all the ones we have running here with this expert advisor. This is a system that possibly trades, well, maybe American indices. This portfolio mainly trades indices and gold, and it's very trend following, okay? It's a very trend following portfolio. So if this one here is a trend following strategy, for example, then the others might be trend following strategies on other assets, or they could be breakout strategies, or maybe one is a mean reversion strategy. In the end, this portfolio is built around the idea that it's a swing trading portfolio. It's a portfolio that usually holds trades for about a week. Anything shorter than that or anything that's more intraday, I keep in another portfolio. And anything that's much longer term, I don't trade anymore because it's too slow for my taste. But this is the performance, as I said, of a single strategy. So if we're going to operate with a, a portfolio, what we need to do is backtest and optimize and come up with a strategy like this one, and then go look for another strategy that's different from this one. And this is very important. Technically, this is known as a strategy that is uncorrelated with this one or has a low correlation. We'll look for a strategy that isn't like this one, that doesn't win when this one wins, that doesn't lose when this one loses, or if it does, that it doesn't always do so, okay? That it doesn't always win when this one wins and doesn't always lose when this one loses, so that it complements this one. In this way, when this strategy uh, fails and goes through very sideways periods, for example, look here from 2020 to almost 2022, it's been a period where this strategy did nothing, okay? That's two years where it did nothing. So what we're interested in is finding other strategies that perform well during periods when this one is doing poorly. And in this way, we can achieve a system that always wins or wins a lot, okay? It won't spend a lot of time, many periods, moving sideways, nor will it experience big drawdowns or many losses because everything will be more smoothed out. When some lose, others win, and when some win, others lose. 
All right, now let's see how all of this looks in practice. I'm going to activate the rest of the systems and let's see what we get. All right, I've activated all the systems. Now they're all set to true. Now then um, let's see how this portfolio works and what we've achieved. Let's run the backtest again. And let's pay attention now to how the performance curve changes what we had before and what we're going to get now. I don't remember exactly how many trades we had before. I'm not sure if it was around 200 or more. I can't recall right now. In any case, let's focus on what we're doing now. Notice that we no longer have those sideways periods. Also, look at the return we've achieved and what a beautiful performance curve we have. It almost looks perfect, doesn't it? If we look at the backtest results, notice that the profit factor is the same as what we had before, but now we've made 14,000 euros in, uh, in net profit, 14,000 euros in profit over a 10-year period, starting with a 5,000 euro account. Obviously, if we start with more, we can make much more, but this is already very good. We've tripled the account over a 10-year period. The drawdown has been only 4.59%, which means we've been operating with low risk. Actually, we could use much more leverage. We could go double or triple, but I'm running this account on DarwinX. What's special about DarwinX is that you can access investor capital, so I prefer to optimize my systems well, and then uh, let the investor's capital be what uh, generates higher income for me through performance fees. What I really want here is to have an account, a strategy that is well optimized to work very well with a certain amount of capital. But when it comes to getting returns from it, it's much better to bring in investor capital and earn through performance fees. Also, if I don't put a lot of capital into this account, for example, I could put 20,000 euros into this account, but then what happens with the other accounts I'm also managing? I think as of today, I already have five accounts or well, one of them. In fact, two of them are already with virtual capital, which are the Darwin Zero account and the FTMO account. And then I have three other DarwinX accounts that are funded with my own capital. But if I want to fund each account with a significant amount of capital, in the end, what I'll be able to do is have fewer accounts. Therefore, it's better to have accounts with enough capital for them to work well and to be able to open more accounts for different types of trading strategies. So here, these are the returns we've achieved with the portfolio. These are much better returns. Look at the sharp ratio. It's already at 3.5. This is exceptional. This sharp ratio is really hard to achieve, honestly. And we'll see if this portfolio in the long run performs as well as it has here in the back test. This takes a lot of time, okay? No, it's not something you're going to see in two months, in three months, not even in a year, two years. This strategy won't look nearly as good in just two years. But when you've had it for so many years, then you really can achieve something like this, okay? So, well, these are the conclusions. This is my approach. This is how I trade. And this is how I would recommend you trade as well. If you want to learn algorithmic trading with us, you can do so on our Academy's website, academy.greatwaves.com. On our website, we provide all the information about our courses and the training we offer. And there you'll learn about all the benefits of algorithmic trading. And you'll also get to know a bit about me, your instructor, as well as the different courses and packages we offer right? Our entire educational offering. As of today, we have three packages. The first package is programming for beginners. In this package, you will learn how to program a trading bot, how to use AI to help you code these bots, and also how to deploy them on a VPS so they can operate 24 hours a day, seven days a week or rather, five days, since markets are usually closed on weekends. This is the bootcamp package for beginner algorithmic trading. And here you have everything that's included. If you have any questions, you can write to me and I'll be happy to answer you. The next package includes these three courses, which are part of the first package, as well as other programming courses that are more advanced and will help you create an expert advisor, a trading bot with a much more reusable, functional and efficient structure. In addition to other techniques to complement the expert advisor, such as using dates and time, risk management and the ability to trade multiple symbols from the same expert advisor. Finally, the last of the packages, which is the new package I just launched, teaches you everything from before that is everything about creating expert advisors and trading bots with the MQL5 programming language. And it also includes our new course, which is about creating profitable and robust systems. In this course, I'm going to teach you what actually works in the markets. I'll show you how to design a strategy to trade the market. And I'll also teach you how I use a bot I've developed to trade that strategy to backtest and optimize it. So you end up with a strategy that works.
Then we'll take that strategy and combine it with another strategy to evaluate how to build a portfolio. In other words, we'll see how to build a portfolio even though we don't yet have the course where I teach you how to create portfolios in MQL5. All right, so this is the educational offering. If you want to start small to test the waters, you have the beginner's pack and you can always upgrade to one of the higher level packs later on. Now, in addition to all this, something I've just recently added is the community, okay? And what I want to do here is create a community of traders where we all speak the same language and are equally motivated by trading. For me, trading is practically like a game. I love it. I have a great time researching edges, exploring markets, seeing what works, testing new rules, programming them, running into issues with the programming. And then um, when I finally get it, there's that joy of having created something. This is something I truly love. And I want equally passionate traders in this community, in this academy, who are committed and with whom we all speak the same language. That's why in this community, which for now I've set up on Discord, we have two sections. We have a public section where I share a ton of free resources with you. Here I'm already sharing all the bots I've created on the YouTube channel, the bots generated with artificial intelligence. And I also share updates and news about everything I'm releasing, as well as promotions and discounts so you can get our courses at better prices. This is what's available in the public space, open to everyone. And then in the private area, well, here we have, uh, this is amazing, okay? Because I'm giving this for free to everyone who completes all our courses, okay? Everyone who enrolls in all our training. This is the filter I use to see which traders want to go all in. Um, and it also ensures that they'll know the entire MQL5 uh, programming language, as well as our working methodology and everything else. As I said, I want traders who are highly motivated and who are all on the same wavelength, who speak the same language. So these traders who have purchased all our training, I give them free access to this private area. And here what we'll have is a collaborative space among all these traders who are super motivated, who love this, who speak the same language and who know trading, where we'll share ideas for strategies, already validated strategies and in short completed resources. For example, the source code of the expert advisor from the robust systems course, I'm sharing it here. Other reusable code, templates, uh, basically anything we want, uh, as well as technical Q&A for different issues we might have or just casual chat. Here we have, well, a very healthy and a very good community to support everything related to algorithmic trading, okay? It hasn't been launched yet, but it's very likely that by the time you're watching this video, it will already be available and you'll have the invitation link here. All right, one more thing that I almost forgot. In the course on uh, building profitable and robust systems, I share a bot with you, okay? This is the bot that we backtest and optimize with a profitable strategy on of my best strategies that has worked for the last 15 years. And this bot includes all the code we teach in all the other courses, plus some additional rules that I'll gradually be bringing into these courses, okay? That's why I've called it, this bot is called MA Master, and it's the master bot, all right? It's the one that incorporates absolutely everything. And as I release new courses that explain new features we can add to this bot, I'll also keep it updated. And all of this will be available here in the community as well. All right, that's all for this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give us a like, subscribe and hit the bell. It really helps us out a lot. And if you have any questions, leave them for us in the comments. I'll be happy to read and uh, respond to you. See you in the markets. See you soon.